This is free. Yeah, I was going to say, that looks free. <laughs> for now. <laughs> for now. This free -ish. is This is the way it looks from uh, Live Cop to 3 over the American River Inn. Now, that's the way to spend a Thursday afternoon. Yeah. Yeah, just, just floating down the river, just, just floating. Or you could come in here and do news. This is more fun. <laughs> we have 101 in Sacramento, so yeah, the water feels pretty good, but the temperature is actually lower than it was yesterday at this time. And the thing you're going to notice tonight is the temperatures will drop off faster than last night. Last night it stayed so warm. By midnight, we'll be in the low 70s. Last night, many areas are still in the mid 80s at midnight with that cloud cover and even the sprinkles we had. Here's how much cooler it is. We're down four degrees. I know that's not a lot, but we're starting the down, downward trend and we'll accelerate that into the day tomorrow. So tomorrow will be a more comfortable day. We are seeing a couple of showers and thunderstorms today, but it's a lot less extensive than what we saw yesterday. And today, the few showers we're seeing are on the crest of the Sierra and onto the east side, so east of the state line. So a lot less shower activity, a lot less concern today about lightning started fires. So today, at least, we're getting a bit of a breather. But into the next couple of days, some spots are likely to see more afternoon showers. This is Friday morning. We will see a nice, comfortable morning, maybe some marine layer into some Solano County and then in the afternoon. This is four o'clock showers around Tahoe desolation wilderness, but nothing widespread. But if you're going to be around Tahoe tomorrow afternoon, just keep your eye in the sky. All of that will dissipate tomorrow night and then Saturday we will repeat that same thing. Saturday will be a warm day highs in the mid to upper 90s and then in the afternoon. A couple of showers will pop up in the Tahoe Basin again, so maybe not the best weekend to go for a hike in the desolation wilderness as it looks like both Friday and Saturday. We will be seeing those afternoon showers and then into the day Sunday, Monday. That's when we may start to see some of the rain get into the Tahoe Basin from the remnants of the hurricane. So tomorrow afternoon thunderstorms in Tahoe and Truckee, but not Pollock, not Arnold, not in the Yosemite Valley where highs will be in the upper 80s and low 90s in the foothills cooler tonight. Overnight lows tonight will drop down to the low 70s. And then highs tomorrow 90s like 92 in Placerville, 94 degrees in Auburn, a warm day, but a little bit lower than what we're seeing today. I'll tell you the biggest cooling is going to be on the coast. Nice onshore breeze, the marine layer building Napa, a high of 80 Fairfield, only mid 80s tomorrow and for the valley. A cooler night tonight and a cooler day tomorrow. We'll have mostly sunny skies with a high of 90 in Stockton, 91 in Tracy. And tomorrow also looks like a nice day around Sacramento with highs in the low 90s, like 92 in Folsom and 90 degrees around Davis. The seven day. We do have increasing clouds in here for Sunday. We're going to include the chance of some rain on Monday. Tuolumne County, it's going to rain. Lake County, it isn't going to rain. Around Sacramento and Stockton, we could see some light rain, less than a tenth of an inch of rain. The clouds clear Tuesday, then we warm in the middle of next week. Back to you. All right, Mark, thank you. Safety at Sacramento State.